We're out of Matataka Cottages, getting ready to do some fossil hunting. Already dropped the wife and the gals off down at the beach, so let's get on down there. So you want to go down this these here steps here. If you want to come fossil hunting in Calvert Cliffs, this is the easiest place to get to. We haven't been to Perth State Park, but definitely a lot easier to get to than Flags Pond. So once you come down the steps. You come into this bamboo forest and then you go on out to the beach here to the good old Chesapeake Bay. And now starts the fossil hunting. So hopefully this is our first tooth of the day. Let's see what it looks like. Yeah, we'll keep that. I'm not sure what it is. Maybe an alligator tooth or something. Or maybe a crab claw. That could be a crab claw. We'll check into it later. So we have one little fossil here. Let me try to get the sun, get it into the sun so you can see it. Right there. It's a nice little gastropod. Torola or something. We'll put that in the bag and see if there's anything else in here. Yep, there's one right there. Got two in there. That's all I see in here right now. Well, let's do some more pans. So I found this little guy on there. Let's bag him. So we're here. We're here at the some of the ex cliff that's ex exposed. What happens is this cliff will collapse and puts all the fossils right into the water for us to find. All that gray layer there is where all the fossils are. get a little closer so you're not allowed to dig into the cliffs but if you look you see all those shells in there that used to be the bottom of the the seabed check all that out in there megalodons all kind of sharks and whales and porpoises. Forty, right around 40 million years ago. Let's look for more fossils. There's so much ground to cover. Shark teeth or anything could be hiding anywhere.
There could be something hiding in this little chunk of mud. Hopefully we find some shark teeth. Get to see wildlife too. But is it ex it is dangerous to be under here for too long because all those trees up there could just come right on down. Bald eagle. If you want to see a delicious creature in the wild, let's see if we can focus in on him. See him? That is a huge crab right there. He'd look good on a dinner plate. So I'm to the point where I'm down as far as I want to go. So let's make our way back and see if we can see anything we didn't see and start sifting. I'm sure there's a big meg back that way, but it is what it is. This is a good example of what is in that gray layer. All those shells. I guarantee you there's shark teeth in there. All kind of stuff. Look, there's a shell that's still together. Be nice to find some shark teeth here. I've never found a shark tooth here. But it is what it is. You're out looking for fossils and you can't complain about that. So, since we've seen that crab down there at the fossil hunting place, my stomach started hurting, and I'm like, you know what, I want to eat some crabs, so guess what we got? Let's check it out. Yummy. yummy crabs. Let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, look at those crabs in there. What do you think, Maya? Good. Good? Yes, let's check them out again. They are going to be so good. Oh yeah. And it's raining outside. Okay, so we didn't find too much while we were down there. But uh, I did find this clam. Let me see if I can get it focused in. So we found this clam completely sealed up pretty nice just fossilized just as it lied in the seabed then I found this shell and it has all kind of little shells inside of it thought that was pretty cool got this show it's almost complete it's got the uh, barnacle stuck to it and they got this fossilized crab claw and a bunch of turritellas I found a bunch of them in this one little patch and I didn't even keep all of them there's so many of them and I found this this shell is twisted off with a bunch of matrix still in there and it looks like there's even a turretella in there So, let me know in the comments if you want to see this all cleaned up and see what that looks like. And then I'll go ahead and clean it up and take pictures. 
thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you like watching travel vlogs or f fossil videos. Thanks.